Power World on the ROG Ally runs pretty good. I've been playing it since it came out. Uh, I've had no issues whatsoever, and I wanted to go ahead and just show you the different settings that I'm using in order to maintain the best battery life, but as well as get the best graphical settings as well. These are two different settings. I'm going to be showing you 30 frames per second at 1080p, and then you also get 60 frames per second at 720. So just in order to do that, you're going to go to your command center. Right now, I have it set to 1080p resolution with the 15 watt power uh, power operating mode. There is no custom mode. This is just the standard 15 watt. And as you can see here, I got 39, around 40 frames per second running that with these options enabled. So I'm going to go into graphics. I do have it set to 60 just to show you how far up it goes. But I would recommend setting that down to 30 so that you just get a smooth 30 frames per second. Being sync is turned on. Anti-aliasing is set to FXAA. View distance is either low or medium. You could try medium. It shouldn't affect it all too much. Grass details is set to low. Shadows is medium. Effects quality is low. And texture quality is medium. And with that, you should be getting uh, your steady 30 frames per second at 1080p. Now, if you wanted to and you wanted to do 60 frames per second, just go ahead and drop that resolution down to 720 go back into your options and your graphics, and then just go ahead and bump that up to 60. So it does display that. And you should be getting your 60 frames at uh, 720 with the same graphics, same operating mode at 15 watts. Of course, if you wanted to, you could plug it in, go to the full 30 watt power mode, uh, boost up those textures just a little bit more, and you should still maintain that 60 frames per second. As you see here, it does jump between 55, 53 to 60, depending on where you're looking and what's happening on the display. But that's obviously expected in this type of situation. The game looks amazing. I've had no issues. Um, it runs pretty smooth and I am enjoying it so far. If you have any any of your own recommendations that you want to leave in the comment section down below of course you can always go ahead and make a manual operating mode of your own uh power wattage just boost it up to 18 and you would get yourself uh, a little bit more on that if you wanted to and you're not getting any smooth uh, 60 frames per second you can always boost up that wattage to 25 watts and you'll get yourself your 60 there of course, just trying to maintain and get a little bit more battery life, you might want to go ahead and set that to 15 or just make a manual profile of around 18 and you should get that smooth 60 at 720. If you have any recommendations for power modes or any type of settings, please feel free to let me know in the comment section down below. This should also work with the stream deck. Pretty much all the same settings should work. Um, just depending on your command center. I know the Steam Deck is a little bit more different when it comes to that, but the graphical settings within the game should pretty much be the same across both handhelds. But that's pretty much it for today. Just wanted to show you what settings I'm using on my ROG Ally to play Power World. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to leave a comment, subscribe, like, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.